What's going on, everybody? So we're about to jump into a game right now. Obviously, I'm still rocking. I think I had an 80 overall team, and I just went back to playing regular Mutt. I just started getting tired of the salary cap because it just seems like aggressive power was turned up to 1,000. Um, in regular Mutt, it's about 556. But um, in salary cap, it's like 1,000, bro. Like, dudes just do whatever. You just throw the ball up in the air, and it, you're pretty, you're helpless, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's like you walk into a prison cell, and Mike Tyson is in there naked. Like, bro, what do you think he's in there to do? You see what I'm saying, bro? Like, he's not there to greet you in a nice manly fashion. You know what I'm saying? You're going to get that work. Um, but that's besides the point. The bottom line is I just don't really care anymore. And at this point, I know that the cards, they're all the same. Um, recently, I fired my entire squad again uh, live on stream. I left it up as one of my past broadcasts on Twitch. I didn't even feel like, you know, keeping any video footage or whatever, or editing it. I don't care. You guys can watch it all throughout. Um, you know, the, the, I, I put higher overalls in now. And then I played a couple games, and it's the same shit. They, they all drop the ball. It doesn't matter, bro. Everything is just like, it, it's just so ridiculous, man. And people are like, yo, you know, it's always that fucking douche. Like I'm saying, yo, I just, people got to be very, very thankful for the internet, dog. Because, you know, hey, yo, bro, yo, 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 pick me. Oh, yeah. Um, it's just really... It just, it's really annoying when, when when you lose to a bum. Like right now, look, I'm throwing the ball in the coverage because I don't care anymore, but in previous Maddens, I wouldn't do that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I, I had to adjust because if you don't adjust to this ridiculousness, you're gonna lose every game. You gotta throw the ball in the coverage because that's how, I'm gonna tell you this right now. A lot of the dudes that are on my friends list, they were telling me at the beginning of the year, bro, just throw the ball up. I'm like, nah, that doesn't make any sense. How, how am I gonna get rewarded for it? And these guys have unbelievable records because they don't give a fuck. And I'm over here sitting here losing to Mad Bums, having more losses than I've ever had in any Madden because I'm trying to make reads. Bro, F reads. You know what I'm saying? Like this dude right here, he's down 14 zip, right? Look at, you're gonna see the stuff that this guy's gonna start to get. And you know, I, I just don't understand why, why allow us to click on. If, if you're gonna make everything be scripted, just let, you know, just take away the buttons. Just let us talk into the mic like, all right, out route. You know what I'm saying? So that way we're not really doing anything and then we let the computer decide what the fuck's gonna happen. Cause when you're standing there holding your remote, it's like, why am I holding this in my hand? It doesn't mean anything. Like that, I'm gonna drop the pick. I'm not even worried about it. See, see drop picks, that, that right there has been going on for a while. So I'm having a set tripping with that, but it's just, it, it, be, it became excessive after the last tuning update. A lot of things became wild after the last tuning update. But the one thing that has remained consistent is the tip drills and ridiculous see the shit how it glitches up and then he picks it like what who would who would want that to happen you see what i'm saying like okay i got it dotted that right there that, that was a great read he ran a post route i wasn't even playing any d i think i might have got stuck on my alignment but it, it don't matter I, I got many more excuses if you want more i just got dotted um i'm surprised he didn't slide into my dms right there like bruh everything about it is so ridiculous and okay he gets right off the block exactly at the point where i'm about to run it for six um it's just it, it's really really it, it comes down to the fact that you always gonna get, did he catch that in bounds? I just, I just did some crazy shit. I, I saw somebody do that against, but I just thought I could run one way and throw the ball back to the other way and it worked. I guess I'm gonna keep doing dumb shit like that. Um, but it becomes overwhelming. And you always get those guys that always ask the same question. Typically, I'm gonna tell you the kind of guys that ask that question. It's, it's, it's usually um, guys with very, very small penises that ask you, why do you still play the game? Because as men, we understand something. Even with the younger guys that play it, you gotta understand, we take responsibility for our actions. Like, you know, there's there's a lot of guys that do a lot of bodily harm to themselves and things like that. That's what they choose to do because of Madden 16. Look, I'm not gonna do all that dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? I, I what the fuck? Oh, damn, it's the end of the half. I couldn't call a timeout. You know, we, we handle it in different ways, but we make the decisions based on what we wanna do. If you if you like football or you love it the way I do, um, if you played it the way I do, you wanna play a football game. It's like, it's like basketball players that play an NBA 2K or, you know, ex-athletes that play these games that they actually, you know, really played in real life. You want a game to play. And this is the game that's available. So we are going to find ways to make it acceptable. The problem is sometimes it's just too much. You know what I'm saying, bro? It's like, I can't really, it's like you eat, you, you ate your dinner, you're full, but there's that one piece of fucking whatever, meat, chicken, if you're a vegan, it's that one piece of fucking broccoli. It's that one piece left. And you're like, you know what? I could fit it in my stomach. That's too much, bro. You know what I'm saying, bro? You don't need that. Yo, bro, put it to the side. Put it in the fridge. You can have it the next day. But you find a way to deal with your gluttonous fucking acts. You understand? We all find ways to make excuses for the things that we want to do. I'm letting you guys understand this. I don't know what the hell that was, but this shit by EA Sports. 
this game, I don't, I can't really describe it in a word what it is. Because when you think nothing ridiculous can happen more than what has already transpired, it shows you you're wrong. This game has to be an experiment on mankind. And it's somebody in a lab that's doing reviews on it. It has to be. It, it doesn't make any sense that this would be approved by a board. Uh, look, I don't know what the hell. I, you know, he should have fucking ripped his neck off. This was approved by a board of uh, you know corporate directors to be released. It's not any one person that's responsible. You know, a lot of you guys go crazy and what? Listen, it's not one guy. That, oh, 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 if you'd have caught that that dumbass animation, he probably gonna dot me right here though. This should be a dot. Okay, no, it's not a dot. What, what is this? Why, why is he not getting bit? Oh, it's fourth down. He got to catch this. This is fourth down. This is fourth down right here. Hell yeah, and then lay on me. Are you comfortable, bro? Are you comfortable? I'll just make it short. I was, yo, yo, I, I, yo, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, and then people want me to keep talking about having commentary after shit like that happens. Like, it's very difficult to have commentary, but shit like, okay, yeah, the ball's already in the ground, but you know what I've been noticing too? Guys, the next time I stream, listen, just make sure you go to uh, uh, Twitch. Oh my God. What the fuck? Okay, look, next, guys, just go to Twitch um, and search Gmaya's World and uh, just just follow. You'll get the alert when I go live because I can't really explain the shit that goes on in this game by any one video. You have to actually see it when it happens, bro. Like, you can look at it now, now you can rewind it. Like, how the hell did he catch that? Why the hell is everybody doing an OBJ catch? Why the hell, you know what I'm saying? Like, what the hell is that, bro? Why is there a porcupine on the field? Like, and it, it's just crazy shit that goes on in this game. I don't even know how to explain the things that happen anymore. You know, I'm sitting here, you know, I have my homeboy come through. He's like, yo, what's good, what you doing? I'm like, I'm playing Madden 16. He's like, what? He's like, but bro, you, you know, I watch your videos, you, you hate the game. I'm like, bro, you wanna fight? You see what I'm saying, bro? Like, it, it, it really, it, it starts to deteriorate uh, relationships as well. You see what I'm saying, bro? Because, like, I don't really give a fuck. Like, if, you, if you're if you around me and I'm playing this game, I become very, very volatile. That's why my family stays away from me. I go into my man cave, I lock the fucking door, and then I'm, I'm going to have to put actually soundproof things in. Uh, soundproof um, uh, padding in, in, in my fucking man cave, bro. Because, they, they, you know, the neighbors are starting to hear me if they think I'm fucking in here dying or killing somebody. Because, it, you know, when a guy comes out and just aggressive catches the fuck out of you for no reason. It is no logical reason that you should be aggressive catch with the veracity that it happens to you and it's so miraculous and the mirac I don't even know why I'm using the actual verbiage. Like what the fuck man? What listen I understand one on one guys are gonna make plays. You know what I'm saying? I understand that. You know what I'm saying? But but it's just cr why is it every time? Why is it every so nobody can play D? There's never been a Deion Sanders one-on-one. -on -one. There's never been a Darrell Rivas one-on-one. -on -one. You know what I'm saying, bro? Like, Night Train, Big Cock Lane. There's never been anybody that could beat somebody up one-on-one. -on -one. What was the dude's name from watching the Redskins? Uh, Green? Like, there's never been anybody that's been that good? Come on, bro. It's ridiculous, man. But it is what it is, bro. It's Madden 16, and I'm going to keep playing it until I'm dead. One love. <laughs>